Hello, Kirill from Terminus here. Today I want to tell you more about a new feature we launched recently. We call it MultiKey. If it's daunting for you to manage SSH keys in your team or just want more control over this process, it will become indispensable helper for you. Let me show how it works in Terminus. I've already created a demo team where Lee is a team owner, Stan is an editor and Jim a regular member. If you want to use MultiKey in your team, you need to set it up and you can do it in Keychain. Here you will find MultiKey section where we have already created a MultiKey for your team and you just need to set up a default username in your team. Next, you can check the list of SSH keys generated for your MultiKey. Those keys are generated automatically per device at the term of start and their public paths are synced to Terminus Cloud. The best thing is that the private paths of the SSH keys never leave the device. So Terminus always keeps a fresh authorized keys file that you can download locally. You can use this authorized keys and export it to your remote servers using your CLI tool. You can do it manually, but alternatively you can create an export snippet. And uh, it's a regular snippet that you can find in Snippets panel. The name is Export Multi-Key. You can check a code and uh, modify it as you want, according to your internal requirements. So, uh, if you already have an infrastructure in terms like me and you want to share it with your team members, you can do it easily. Just share it and connect to your server. And you can export multi-key. If you want to deliver authorized keys to several servers at once, you can use snippet multi-execution in terms for mobile devices. Let me show how it looks like. In mobile device you can still find Snippets panel. Tap on Export Multi Key, select host that you want to update, and just run Snippet. Yeah, it's done. When you upload authorized keys to your remote servers, your team members will get access to a shared host without need to set up their own credentials. They just need to choose multi-key during connection. Let's check, let's check how it looks like for Jim. So let's connect to Ubuntu, choose multi-key and click continue. Here we are. As you can see now, you don't need to store your public keys in different places and waste your time keeping them up to date. All of them will be available in Terminus. And MultiKey will help you to get a fresh authorized keys file from the whole team and upload it to remote servers just in few taps. That's all for today. See you guys.